Hi, boys and girls. I'm going to read The Bad Seed. This book is written by Jory John and illustrated by Pete Oswald. If you have this book at home, feel free to grab it and you can follow along with me. I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. Oh yeah, it's true. The other seeds, they look at me and they say, that is, that seed is so bad. When they think I'm not listening, they mumble, there goes a bad seed. But I can hear them. I have good hearing for a seed. How bad am I? You really want to know? Well, I never put things back where they belong. I'm late to everything. I tell long jokes with no punchlines. I never wash my hands. Or my feet. I lie about pointless stuff. I cut in line every time. I stare at everybody. I glare at everybody. I finish everybody's sentences and I never listen. And I do lots of other bad things too. Know why? Because I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. I just can't help it. Sure, I wasn't always this bad. I was born a humble seed on a simple sunflower in an unremarkable field. I had a big family, seeds everywhere. We found ways of having, having fun. We were close. But then the petals dropped and our family dropped. It's kind of a blur. Sunflower seeds, delicious. I remember a bag. Uh oh, they ended up in a bag of sunflower seeds. Everything went dark. And then, then, a giant. Uh oh, there's a human eating the sunflower seeds. I thought I was a goner. I thought I was done for. I screamed and I hollered. Ah! But I was spit out at the last possible second. I flew through the air and I landed under the bleachers with a huge thud. When I woke up, it was dark outside. A wad of gum had softened my thought fall. I felt okay, but something had changed in me. I'd become a different seed entirely. I'd become a bad seed. A bad seed. That's right. I stopped smiling. I kept to myself. I drifted. I was friends with no one and bad to everybody. I was lost on purpose. I lived inside a soda can. I didn't care and it suited me. Until recently, I've made a big decision. I've decided I don't wanna be a bad seed anymore. I'm ready to be happy. It's hard to be good when you're used to being bad, but I'm trying. I'm taking one day at a time. Sure, I still forget to listen. And I still show up late. And I still talk during movies and I do all kinds of other bad stuff. But I also say thank you. And I say please. And I smile. And I hold doors open for people. Not always, but sometimes. And even though I still feel bad sometimes, I also feel kind of good. It's sort of a mix. And all I can do is keep trying and keep thinking. Maybe I'm not such a bad seed after all. Hey, look, there goes that bad seed. Actually, he's not all that bad anymore. I heard that. The